Hello and welcome to a new charter number 23 of Azure Support Academy. In this new episode, number 10, we are going to talk about the error 40197. The service has encountered an error processing your request. My name is Jose Manuel Jurado. I am a Scalation Engineer in working in Microsoft and subject matter expert in this technology. But what is the reason that is, ca is causing this problem? Basically, we need to understand that this error occurs when we are running a transaction and SQL Server, for any specific reason, uh, lost they lost the connection, uh, lost the connection. They have a hardware problem. Uh, multiple things cause this problem. Okay, but normally it's when we run a transaction and the connection with the database is lost. Uh, of course, that when this situation happens, all the transactions, any open transactions that we have, uh, will be uh, rolled back. How to find the problem? What well, basically is using an error message, because on the end it's very uh, it's uh, it's needed that our application capture all this message. Finally, is how to fix the problem. Well, in this part, uh, the first thing that I think that is we need to review the aspect of uh, our servers, right? Is something happened with the server, hardware, software, etc. In this case, Azure SQL DB basically could means that. Uh, we have a performance issues, okay, or uh, that in this case we need to implement the retry logic at common executions in order to retry the operations, or we have any issues in, in the server uh, that cause this problem. Well, in order to reproduce the issue, we are going to use the same application that we have and we, uh, we used previously for multiple things. Uh, we are going to run this application. We are connecting to one database. Uh, we are going to run, we are going to do the following. We are going to insert around 1 million for rows running a bulk insert. Um, at the moment of this bulk insert, uh, I'm going to uh, run a specific command in order to uh, restart my SQL Server. Okay, so I'm going to, to run this one. Basically, as we mentioned, I'm creating a new table. This table basically is, is going to, to run uh, this number of million, uh, millions creating a small uh, data row. And after it, I'm going to run uh, uh, the will copy. Basically, the will copy, as we mentioned before, it's basically, uh, it's to run uh, this will copy using a transaction. Uh, and I'm going to run this process, basically. So I'm going to, uh, as I mentioned before, I'm sorry, before to go this one, uh, as I mentioned before, uh, my policy in terms of, of retry, it's I'm going to retry the operation multiple times, um, at least three times. If something happened in, in this process, I'm going, uh, for example, the, I lost the connection. Suppose that uh, the connection is, was not possible or I have, in this process, a, a SQL or this option detect that I lost the connection, reconnect again, and continue working with the, with the, with the, uh, to retry the operation. So I'm going to run this one. So as you can see right now, it's going to in, insert the data. And uh, meanwhile, we have this data. I'm going to, I'm going to uh, uh, execute uh, this process in order to 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 lose the connectivity against the against the server. Okay, let's do it right now. For example, this saw the error. Let's try to continue with with this. Okay, so let's see if we have the error here. Yeah, so right now in the middle that uh, bull copy process is inserting the data to SQL Server, uh, they detect that 
something happened in this transaction that it is not possible to contribute because I lost the, the connectivity, I lost everything, SQL Server was restarted, I don't have access. So in this case, as you can see, we have this error. So the, the error is, is this. So that's mean that let me, uh, yep. Yeah. So copy and paste this. I'm going to stop the application. And basically this is the error. The error means that the service has encountered an error, processing your request, uh, blah, blah. Okay, perfect. So we are able to reproduce the issue. Um, as, as I mentioned before, it's, it's very important to retry the operation. It's something happening in, in this part, right? So uh, for the reason in this part, in this application, uh, I have a retry logic uh, implemented in, in the execution. So basically it's uh, when they run this process, let me stop, let me remove this uh, breakpoint. Yep. So it's inserting right now, it's inserting the data. I'm going to, for example, stop the application right now. So I receive, let me, I'm going to do one thing. It's to remove one second, to remove the comment, just only in order to see what is the process without need to do anything. Sorry, one second. So we are going to do the same. Process running, process is running. Okay, we are reading, writing right now the, the data. If I have this problem, I'm going to receive the error message. The error message report the, the, the option, but automatically they retry the operation and go again the process. So this is the, the process that we have in order to uh, return the, 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 the operations in this part. Okay, thank you so much for attending these sessions. If you have any questions, please send an email to gmjurado at microsoft.com.